So we're just five days away from the entire NFL, back to training camp. I can smell the football season, and not the aroma in the locker room, but just the <laughs> yeah, return of football. So, good. so today, the Cowboys and Steelers, they get a head start before everybody else. Plenty of question marks for both franchises as we get into the regular season. What's the famous thing from the 90s uh, for the Cowboys when they were winning? How about them, Cowboys? Yeah. They're back in their normal training camp site of Oxnard, California, after spending last year's COVID season in Frisco, Texas. And it looks like Dallas near full vaccination heading into training camp. Both league and players association would like to see 85% or so among their teams in the league. And the Cowboys will be featured, by the way, HBO's Hard Knocks again. This will be the third time for the franchise that has the most Hard Knocks appearances in its history. The attention is something Jerry Jones likes, and he wants another chip. I'd do anything known to man to get in a Super Bowl. That's a fact. And uh, uh, there's, uh, uh, there's nothing in my mind that can uh, uh, b have a pri higher priority than that. The thing that means the most to me and I care about, and I could probably be anywhere in the world I want to be right now. I want to be here uh, with our team. Mike McCarthy entering his second season as head coach will look for a full season from his quarterback Dak Prescott. Prescott coming off a terrible ankle injury in week five forced him to miss the rest of the season but he is back and besides saying that he almost wrecked his trunk when he found out they'd be on hard knocks McCarthy channeling his inner Ryan Fitzpatrick says Dak's going to be a full go. I mean uh, unless something comes out of the medical uh, you know the medical meeting I, I see for him to be a full participant. And uh, but, you know, it's you know, still projection and see how it goes. Obviously, we're, we're going to watch it. But uh, the, the way we approach the offseason program was to keep him out of the team drills. Um, but he will participate in the team drills. So that, that was really the last hurdle as I view it in practice. Brandon, did you take your glasses? I was going to say that beard and chase, he's definitely now a Texan after shots. Is that what it is? All right. Oh, what is this? By the way, if you type in Big Ben in a Google search, Brandon, uh -huh. what do you think auto fills the page? A uh, bigger Ben. The way this no, it's right. actually weight loss. Oh. One headline okay. reads, look, Ben Roethlisberger looks great at Steelers camp after major weight loss. Mm. Okay. Mm. Brandon's still skeptical. Must Pittsburgh's been. quarterback turned up the first day of Camp sporting a shirt that reads different with signs of him reportedly having a strict diet. Yeah. <laughs> he's, a, he's always going to be a big fella, right? Arms only. Uh, he has been criticized in the past, listed on the Steelers roster at 240. Sometimes it's more, although then maybe less. Two-time Super Bowl champion during his 18th season with the Steelers. Pittsburgh off the board here at 40 to 1 to win the Lombardi next year, tied with Minnesota and Arizona at William Hill. But everyone chasing Kansas City. Chiefs are the betting favorite at 5-1. to one. Do you want a sports network that delivers everything that matters about the game? The highlights, the picks, the instant analysis. No yelling, no fake debates, no politics. Hit the subscribe button and never miss a moment.